Hey gamers, how are you? Welcome to another thoughts and review here in my channel. Recently, I saw one of my favorite YouTubers, Kichur Yuken, talking about this game, that I was completely unaware of his existence, and loving the two original movies back in the 80s. And also because I didn't play a NES game for so long, I gave this game a try. Of course, that I didn't bought the original game for my NES console. Instead, I installed the game in my NES Classic Mini, because not only I save a lot of money, but also, as some of you may know, I love the Classic Mini consoles. About the game, this game was released by Wall Laboratory, but only in Japan and Italy, because unfortunately it was never released in North America, due to a license argument with Activision. As a result, NES players in North America only receive Activision's Ghostbusters 2, and not this one. New Ghostbusters 2 is a top-down action game, based in the second movie. We can pick all four Ghostbusters and also Louis, that becomes a Ghostbuster in the end of the second movie. The graphics are very good for an NES game, and the characters, enemies and bosses have a cute cartoon look, that I found lovely. The music is very cool, it has the 8-bit tunes based in the music of the movie. Now the most important, the gameplay. The gameplay is like every 8-bit game should be, simple and fun. We control one character that fires against the enemies and other controlled by the CPU to activate the ghost trap, just like it was in the movies. We need to kill all the enemies in the room and then an arrow appears on the screen telling which direction we must go so we never get lost. In the end of each stage we have a typical boss fight and after beating the boss we move to the next level. I like the gameplay so much that I didn't let the game until I finish. The enemies and the bosses are ghosts and monsters from the movie and the levels are all from the second movie. We play in the courthouse, the sewers, the museum, among other places always based in the movie. In a negative note, I just found the game a little easy. We finish in 30 minutes or less, but the game is so fun that I already beat the game two times. So my final thoughts. In my opinion, and loving the Ghostbuster since I was a kid, I found this game very enjoyable. And like I said, I already finished the game two times. And for those who didn't saw the second movie, I think we'll also enjoy the game, because of the simple and fun gameplay. 